just like what Autumn Aurelio said, when it's no longer fulfilling, even if you, you're comfortable with what you do, don't hesitate, walk away. Hi everyone, I am Mrs. Archie Lily Gaspi. I made this vlog to share with you my art diary. I want to share with you the most unforgettable moment in my life. So, let's start. First, I brought this journal in Lazada way back 2020. On that year, I am 28 years old. That time, there was a virus spreading worldwide called COVID-19. Wearing a mask become a fashion in that moment. Part of my art style is showing the culture, history, and tradition of my country, which is the Philippines. I also draw something abstract. This is my favorite view in my room when I'm still living in Cebu and still single. I draw some people that I know who are close to me and died during the COVID. Year 2021. I got assigned in my work at Tawi Tawi and become a site HR. February 14, 2021, in Valentine's Day, I got in relationship. My closest auntie died last April 2021. There are times that I am feel and inspired, lazy and anxious. So not all happened in my life put in my art diary. Sometimes I just wrote it instead of drawing. I experienced 9 months long distance relationship. I got engaged on December 25, 2020 Tried to use the by buying. It's an Asian letters or alphabet of the Philippines. I got busy in this year in processing our marriage requirements. And I got married on November 26, 2022 at Bungao Tawi Tawi. Celebrated Pasco or Christmas at the place of my husband. Budul budul when the food arranged in the banana leaf and eat together by hand. I got positive in pregnancy on December 29, 2022. And baby is coming. The biggest decision I made in year 2022 is to quit my regular job that I work for five years. Celebrated New Year again at my husband's place. So, in the new chapter, year 2023, I am officially married person and I have baby coming soon. Reason why I am quit my regular job, I want to pursue what I really wanted to do is to pursue art career. This is my ultimate dream in my life that did not prioritize before because I am lack of confidence and believing that art can sustain the daily needs of my family. Before, I wanted to take a fine art course in college, but my father advised to me that take a course which can easily find a job. So I graduate in college with a degree of Bachelor of Psychology at the University of San Jose Recoletes in Cebu. After that, I work in a mining company as a human resources or HR staff at Mandawi Cebu. Yeah, for five years being HR staff, it really helps to sustain my needs. I can already afford to buy expensive art materials and sustain my family needs. I always prioritize my family when I'm not married yet. But even so, I'm not planning to devote my entire life in HR industry. My marriage is a perfect time for me to pursue my dream. But how? I need to quit my regular job because I can't focus, give more time, and prioritize art if I'm not going to give up my regular job. I can't find a way to get income through art if I'm still depending on my regular job. A lot of people said that art career is not a stable career, but I saw many art YouTube channels that helps me get idea how to make money in art. For 
For the year 2023, I create a plan because I am currently pregnant, so I need to take a rest. I will stay in the house, be a hands-on wife or housewife, and at the same time, I will take this opportunity to improve my art skill and create vlogs. Currently, I am living in my husband's place, somewhere in Tawi-Tawi province. For now, I am dependable to my husband's income. For me, this is a perfect place to start my creative journey because it's far away in stress, less spending, and I with nature. Helps me to focus in studying art. This is my first step to create vlogs, to share my art journey and others that I wanted to share. I will upload a new vlog every evening of Saturday or Sunday. Please follow also my Instagram account to see my new art. Please subscribe my YouTube channel and see you in my next vlogs. Thank you!